Yeah, hello, this is Chris Blasby. I'm talking to you from Riga, um, from where I live. This is, the, this is the river that I live on. It's very nice, isn't it? What a lovely day it is. I just want to say a few words about the chess game that's going on in, uh, at the moment with regard to, uh, to Britain leaving the European Union. Um, there's, there's an aspect of it that's extremely important that people have to, to, to take on board. Um, some friends of mine have, have told me about this, some lawyer friends, and so I'll just present it to you now. As you all know, um, the, the, this has become a kind of battle between Parliament and the King, but we don't have any Cromwell to deal with it. So Parliament tried five times to amend this, um, this, this bill, the withdrawal, uh, the, the withdrawal from, uh, from Europe bill, and was unable to do that, but eventually, of course, the, 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 we we got the Ben the Ben Bill, which is called um, the European Withdrawal Act Number Two, as I understand it. That's right, European Withdrawal Act Number Two. Um, and this was passed by Parliament, of course. So now everybody thinks that that Johnson can't do anything. And to everyone's astonishment, now not, notwithstanding all of the, the the stuff that's happened in the in the in the High Court in in London, now what we call the Supreme Court in London, and also the, the Scottish Court of Sessions, uh, more or less saying that he's the sort of person that we all know that he is. Um, we, 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 he's now saying um, that he, he just will not sign this <coughs> sign this letter to, the, to, to Europe to ask for an extension. He's just refusing to do that. Now, of course, everyone's saying, oh, well, he can't possibly do that. But, I mean, this is a little bit of chess, because remember, the people behind Johnson are really quite clever. They're very good chess players. And so far, they've outwitted everybody at every stage, except, except for this sort of setback with, <laughs> with, the, with the courts. But, of course, they can say that the courts don't have jurisdiction. And ultimately, um, what you have to realize is that it's the, it, it's the civil service, it's the deep state, if you like to see it like that in American terms, that runs the show. So, so, and, and so, so Johnson can say, or at least he can threaten, to go ahead and not write this letter to the Europeans, <coughs> asking for an extension. He can say that, and that is exactly what he's saying. Now, the thing is, why is he saying that? Well, my, my feeling is he's saying that as a sort of... Uh, window is to get everybody excited about what they can do about it. And what he'll do is at the last minute he'll say, oh all right, I give up, I'll write the letter, and he'll write the letter, okay? But the point is this, and no one seems to have figured this out, this is the important point I want to get across now, is that he is allowed, as a member of the European Union, to veto anything that comes to the European Union. He, so he can veto himself. He can veto himself. So he can write a letter saying, I want an extension <clears throat> to January the 1st or to whatever date the European um, the, the European Commission or the Europeans or whoever decides these things uh, allows him to do it. But then he can veto that, you see. <laughs> this is the joke. He is legally allowed to veto it. So Cumming, Dominic Cummings or whoever it is that's, that's figuring all this stuff out, who, who's a chess player, I expect, or I think I know. Um, and this, this is the thing that Parliament must do. Parliament must realise that this is a serious threat. So they have enough time to, to pass another law to say that he can't veto his own um, letter. That's it. That's it. So whoever you know that you can tell about this, or even if somebody uh, is listening to this um, who has some kind of ability to, to, to bring this attention to the, to the movers and shakers in the Parliament, they should do it. Anyway, thank you for listening.